The tennis world has been rocked by a match-fixing scandal that has ended up with a ban for life against a Moroccan player in his 30s, Yunus Rashidi, who was found guilty for over 135 match-fixing offenses in both singles and doubles throughout his career. He also came with a big fine as well. Let's go over and read what the ITIA had to say about this situation and about the ban. This is what the ITIA had to say. The International Tennis Integrity Agency has today confirmed that Yunus Rashidi, a Moroccan former tennis player, has been banned from the sport for life after being found guilty of 135 match-fixing offenses. This is now the highest number of offenses by one individual ever detected by the ITIA or its predecessor, the Tennis Integrity Unit. The sanction means that Rashidi, who had a highest ATP doubles ranking of 470, 73 is permanently prohibited from playing in, coaching at, or attending any tennis event authorized or sanctioned by the governing bodies of tennis. The case was ruled on by independent anti-corruption hearing office Janie Soublair, who found all charges proved, the 135 breaches egregious, and imposed a fine of 34,000 in addition to the life ban. Rashidi was involved in match fixing with two Algerian players recently banned by the ITIA, with the cases uncovered following law enforcement investigations in conjunction Junction with the ITIA in Belgium. So there it is. Rashidi, the biggest match fixer in tennis. And banned for life. Also fined uh, a little bit of money as well, or a lot of money, I guess, for somebody who isn't really up in the top of the game. And he's banned for life. He can't even go to the tennis. He can't even go watch Wimbledon or the Australian Open. He's banned for life from everything tennis, not just playing it. So very interesting stuff. Let me know down in the comments below. What do you think about this? What do you think about match fixing in general? Do you think it's a problem in tennis? There has been a lot of allegations about match fixing in the last 12 months, of course. Players like Karatsev, Basilashvili have been investigated uh, for match fixing over the time, and there's been countless players that have actually been found guilty for match fixing. But Yunus Rashidi is the biggest match fixer or the one with the most offenses in match fixing to tennis to date, and he is banned for life from the sport.